The central bank's decision to eliminate the one-cent coin from our currency due to its high cost of production is being accepted as the right way to go. The bank says it will soon demonetize the coin, but there will be a drive to allow the public to redeem their one-cent coins. Marita Bernard reports. The older folks in the country will remember when one cent could buy a paradise plum or sweet biscuit. Well, long gone are those days and the central bank is making this even clearer by getting rid of the TNT one cent coin. Economist David Walker said getting rid of lower value coins is now an international trend and already persons are accustomed to paying their cents in multiples of fives. We already have that, you know, if you go to any 10 shop, I, I almost defy you to find anything that's not a multiple of 5 cents. I can't think the last time I've, I've seen somebody, okay, I see some people do 2 in order to make it sound closer to 2 than 3. But apart from that, you really don't see anything that's not a multiple of 5. I think stand already anyway. Head of the Downtown Merchants Association, Greg Reboot, said that the value of the one cent piece is negligible. The point is that the one cent piece is almost of no value in the overall um, cost of living. In fact, a fairly substantial argument could probably be made for other coins being removed as well. And the situation is that it costs the provider, who in this case is a central bank, more to provide us with the coin than it, its actual value. And it has very little buying or spending power here. Going even further, Mr. Abood suggests that the bank should consider creating notes of a higher denomination. In the circumstances that we are currently existing, it is very likely that the government could also consider a $500 note uh, as it is in other societies. And um, in fact, even in Jamaica, they have a $1,000 note. And this is in direct relation to the diminishing value of our currency. So yes, the removal of the one cent coin is very understandable and will not in our opinion, affect anything. The central bank said that rules regarding rounding off of the total bill, up or down, will be instituted, and Mr. Bood agrees with this, saying it will not affect much. Mary Therese Bernard, C News.